Good morning, it's Jeremiah with Mobility 316 and today I'm shooting a video of our 2019 Toyota Sienna SE. You can see with the key fob here, I can operate both power sliding doors and the rear trunk hatches has a brand new rear entry super wide 48 inch conversion. Uh, he's easy to operate, low cost to maintain, how you operate the super wide lift. So we got a pull onto this bungee cord here and we got a handle here, we got to grab it and just walk backwards. So I need to pull this out, I'm grabbing the handle. All right, I got it loose. I can simply walk back here, do this with one hand. Super simple to do. 48 inch wide, super wide ramp. Uh, 1,000 pound weight capacity. Most side entries are only 30 inches. So if you're looking to haul a bigger chair or chairs, this might be the solution for you. If someone parks next to you in a side entry van, you cannot get out of your vehicle. Not the case with the rear entry. The rear entry have more ground clearance for getting over rougher terrain, and they're a little more affordable to convert, uh, therefore more affordable for you to purchase. A few of the positives to the rear entry. It's got about 57 inches coming inside the van, then about 56 once you're inside the van. It's got the two tie down, or eight tie down points. So you can get up to two wheelchairs at a time in here, or a gurney or a stretcher. We've got the upgraded Q strength tie downs, brand new, by uh, no cost to you. Now it does, the channel here does, to let this hill tapers in here it does go to about 38 inches right here so any chairs wider than 38 inches will have to be towards the back of the vehicle but hey you can still haul those there's about 29 inches of room between those seats right there so give you extra room to get a wheelchair up in there we've got dual shoulder harnesses here and uh some some of our competition they're selling uh similar conversions like this but they don't offer these upgraded q strength tie downs so these are high dollar we throw those in at no no cost to you so be sure to factor that factor that in when you're comparing us to the competition, which I encourage you to do. Got your upgraded uh, Q strength tie downs and warranties there. Nice center console, plenty of cup holders for all your passengers, both front and rear. Plug ins for all your electronics. Got your heated seats. Got your more cup holders. Your dual climate control, your rear air controls. Dash is in great shape, no cracks or holes in the dash. You got steering wheel controls to keep your eyes on the road. Got your backup camera. And you can also shut all the. Uh, Sliding doors up here as well, and even the trunk as well. And that was the exit of the vehicle. Again, we're just going to reverse the process. Now, our conversion, this one comes with a three-year, 36,000-mile warranty on the conversion, so you're covered there as well. And then on these Toyotas, you can also shut the, uh, all the power doors from the door itself. So, nice, clean van. As I do a walk around, you can see it's got the roof rack, tinted windows, got these 19-inch alloy wheels, really sharp-looking van. And all these tires are about... 8 to 9, 30 seconds of tread left on them. So they're not brand new, but they got a lot of tread left on them, a lot of life left on them. And as I do a walk around, you know, I'm looking for little dents, I'm looking for little scratches. I'm, this van is, is in excellent shape. And that's one advantage of buying from us. It's a little scrape, you know, so I'm probably scraped it on a curb down there, on a tall curb. But you can, if I didn't show you, you probably wouldn't notice. But when you buy from us, I am the owner. I am personally hand selecting every one of our vehicles. A lot of you may not know how the car industry works, but a lot of the big companies, they have a buyer. They go out and they buy and they just get paid two or three hundred dollars for every vehicle they buy. They don't care if it's got a clean title. They don't care if it's a good shape. All they care about is just buying a vehicle so they can meet their quota. Well, I'm the owner. I care about every single one of these vehicles that come through here. I am not just sitting behind a mouse, uh, behind a keyboard, clicking a mouse, buying vehicles left and right. I'm hand selecting each one of them. So that's a big difference between buying from me and buying from the competition. And no matter who you do business with, Make sure you get a video, not just a picture, a video of the VIN number on the side. Now, why I say that? There is so much scamming going on out there. People will take pictures from my website, for example. They'll cut out my name, my, my dealership name, and they'll post them on, say, Facebook, and they'll be selling it for, quote, $10,000 on a $50,000 van trying to get you to send them a deposit. Well, if you were to ask that person, hey, I want you to make a video, I want you to provide that VIN number. Well, they couldn't because, A, they probably don't even live in this country, and, B, this van is here on my lot. They don't have it. They couldn't provide that. So protect yourself out there. Don't get scammed, all right? Also, what we do with that VIN number on a Carfax on every one of our vehicles before we buy it, Carfax shows two owners. There's minor damage. I'll show that to you. It's got eight service records, so it's been serviced regularly. And that's a good thing for a Toyota. Carfax shows no salvage junk, rebuilt, fire, flood, hail, or lemon brands on the title. And they show no total loss. So this is not one of the super risky salvage or rebuilt titles. This is a clean title. Carfax shows no structural damage. Airbags are never deployed. Odometer's accurate. Does show minor damage, uh, no open recalls. 
As we scroll down here again, you can see the vehicle has been serviced regularly. It does show in May of 2022, minor damage uh, is usually including dents or scratches to the vehicle body. Also shows uh, in December 22, also minor damage uh, is usually dents or scratches to the vehicle body. So, you know, maybe had somebody had a couple unfortunate parking lot, you know, bender benders or something like that. I'm not opposed to buying a used vehicle, you know, four-year-old uh, vehicle that's a five-year-old vehicle that's got a, uh, you know, a couple bumpers been painted or something like that. Definitely no major issues, no frame damage, airbags have never gone off. It's got a pretty pretty clean report card. So it does show the oil was last changed at 41,851 miles with new wiper blades as well. So it's got pretty fresh oil in it. And no matter who you do business with, find them online, look up their reputation, check them out. Now look at us on eBay, 1,505 transactions. Every single one of those transactions has left us positive feedback. It's 100%. I'd say that qualifies for a good reputation. And no matter who you do business with, find them on Google. Make sure they are a real company. Again, make sure you're not getting scammed. You can see we are a real company. We're here in Wichita, Kansas. We have a whole bunch of reviews and 4.8 out of 5 star reviews. You know, I talk to people all the time. They talk to me about how they bought a vehicle off Craigslist or Facebook from a private individual. Uh, the vehicle ended up being stolen. They had to give the vehicle back. They lost all their money. Or they end up buying from one of these uh, scammers out there, you know, sending the, sending the money to the scammer, and then they never heard from them again. So just be careful out there who you're buying from. Or they buy from one of these dealers with one and two and two star ratings. You know, I know there's some fellas down in Atlanta and some guys up in New Jersey. They've got two, two, star, two out of five star reviews. I know what they're buying. I watch them at auction. They're buying the rusted out junkers uh, from the East Coast, and they're selling them to you. So... Buying a vehicle is so much more than just price, miles, and the year. So um, just know who you're buying from. Spend 30 seconds. Get online. Check out the reviews and see, see what they're all about. So if you want those two-star vans, you know, let me know. I'll give you their phone number. If you want five-star vans with five-star service from a company that's been doing this for a dozen years, I look forward to working with you. All right, back to the van. We do have one key and one fob. If you want us to get additional ones made on your dime, we can sure do that. You can see a little scratch about the size of my fingernail right here. You see that? Got some touch-up paint on it. Pretty hard to see, but I just noticed that. So if I see it, I want you to see it. Inside the van, I am a non-smoker. I can smell smoke from a mile away. No signs of any smoke or unusual odors in this van. Power seat works great. It's got the black leather interior. It's very clean. And if you're going to use this uh, vehicle for, say, a non-emergency non medical transport for business, you're going to be in and out of these doors all the time, you can hit the power door off button. These doors will open and shut manually. They'll open quickly without any worry of breaking you know, the door motor or anything like that. So, you know, time is money, so that might be something you're interested in doing. Simple, Super simple to do, touch of a button. These back seats here, the nice black leather seating as well. Super easy to clean if they get a spill or any, any fluids on them. And as I enter the van, you can see 44,787 miles. Go to start the van up, it fires right up. It's darn near a full tank of gas. You can see all the dummy lights work and they all go out, so no check engine lights on, no airbag lights, no ABS. Got a backup camera here as well. So, um, like I mentioned, all the dual climate control, got your heated seats. Uh, one thing on Toyotas, the newer GPS on these, uh, there's a, some kind of update that they won't, they're not updating. So there, there's no more map on this on this vehicle, so just heads up, letting you know up front, no map on the van, so. But everything else works fine, tested the radio. I've got three mechanics that work for me. And that radio works fine. And I've, like I said, three mechanics. We've tested all the power mirrors, windows and locks. And I'm gonna show you the mirrors and windows moving up and down. We've tested the heat, air, cruise, belts, hoses, suspension, steering, brakes. Replace fluids as necessary, check the tires, taking them on a road test. And my point is, we do not just throw these vans on the lot. They go through a very thorough inspection before they hit my lot. And I can. I hope you can tell if nothing else by my videos, we are very thorough in everything we do and I, I expect nothing less from my guys. Underneath the hood, we got the 3.5 V6 engine. It idles smoothly, no signs of any damage, no signs of any leaks, and it purrs like a kid, like a well-maintained Toyota. As I crawl underneath the van, much of the same. Very clean, no signs of any bent metal from an accident. No signs of any fluid or any kind of oil or fluid leaks. No signs of any rust, you know, from being in a flood or being up north. That's the number one mistake people make when they buy used vehicles. They assume things. They assume just because it's a low mileage Toyota, they assume it runs and drives good. They assume it's never been in a bad accident 
or a flood, and that's the absolute most dangerous thing you can do when buying a used vehicle. So what I want you to do, I want you to go check out my competition. That's right, I am sending you to the competition. And I want you to ask, I don't care if it's a private individual, I don't care if it's another dealer, but what I want you to ask yourself, do they show me the reputation online? Remember our 1,500 eBay reviews? And our 200 or 300 Google reviews? Yeah, 1,800 people saying we, we, that we're legit business. You know, do, do they show that? Do they show you a Carfax report? So you know you're buying a vehicle that's got a clean title, no major accidents or damage, and never been in a flood. Do they get on their hands and knees and even bother taking pictures, much less a detailed video of the undercarriage, so you know you're getting a vehicle that hasn't been in a major accident, you're not all bent up underneath, you can see there's no water damage. So do they do all that for you? So when it comes to not only price, when it comes to reputation, and when it comes to how thorough they are and showing you the exact vehicle you're getting so there's no surprises, please compare me to the competition. And you know what ends up happening if you end up buying a vehicle uh, that you can't get a title from, a private individual or another dealer? Well, you can't register it. You just bought a paperweight. Or you uh, buy a vehicle that's got frame damage from an accident or even a flood. It may not pass inspection in your state. If it won't pass inspection in your state, again, you, you just bought a vehicle you can't even drive. So no matter who you buy from, demand four things. Demand a detailed video like this. Not some lazy 30-second walk around. You're telling me they're asking you to send forty, fifty, sixty thousand dollars to them, and they're not going to get out and make a detailed video for 15 minutes. Come on now. Second, demand a Carfax report, not some uh, cheap knockoff. I know Carfax costs me thousands of dollars a month, but again, I am doing it. From, I'm buying from your perspective. I want the best of the best. I want to know everything I can about the vehicle before I buy it, and that only benefits you as well. Third, uh, get online, find out who you're buying from. Lazy buyers get scammed. Don't be a lazy buyer. Spend a little bit of time and just make sure who you're talking with is legit and they got a good reputation. And finally, demand a warranty. This fan is just out of the uh, powertrain warranty specs from Toyota, but we do have a 90 day, 3,000 mile drivetrain plus warranty. Go to any shop in the country, including Toyota dealers, and then we throw on the van at no additional charge to you. So we do not sell as is. Every one of our vehicles comes with a warranty and you should never buy as is. Demand that warranty. So let's get her out for a test drive. Okay, the final portion of the video. I always like to get the vans out on the highway, give them some gas so you can hear the engine run. Feel the transmission shift through all the gears, and you know whether you take advantage of our free shipping in the lower 48 states, or if you come in and drive this scene at home. We've done our due diligence, hopped up about 70 miles an hour. See the steering wheel is nice and straight, no unusual vibration or noise. I got the cruise control set. This has the adaptive cruise control, which you know is very it's safe. It'll keep me from so much, so many distance from the car in front of me. So it's a great safety feature to have to make sure you, know, you don't rear end somebody, especially whether it's family or business. You want your vehicle and your and your people in it safe. And also, do keep in mind we offer the 90-day complimentary warranty at no additional charge to you. Uh, we do have longer-term warranties that are bumper-to-bumper -bumper type warranties. Those go anywhere from 90 days all the way up to eight years, and everywhere in between. Talk to me about how you can affordably protect your investment long term. Also, keep in mind, we don't have any hidden fees. A lot of these dealers, they show a real nice price online with that hidden in the fine print, $500 administrative fee, they got document fees, they got tag fees, they got freight, you name it, and they got a hidden fee for it. You know what they don't have? Free shipping. So by the time you've added up all their hidden fees, by the time you add up the cost of shipping, well, that real nice price you saw online, it just jumped three or $4,000 not such a nice price anymore is it so be sure to ask about the shipping and hidden fees before you buy or sit back relax let me take care of all that for you and no additional charge to you my question to you if someone's not telling you the real price of a vehicle if they got a bunch of hidden fees on the back end to try and sneak more money in on you well what else are they hiding from you is it a salvage title is it flood damage is it major mechanical issues you know i can't speak for them but one thing i do know that in any business but especially the used car business, transparency is key. That's exactly why I'm out here making this video today in an attempt to be 100% transparent. So as I come down the uh, ramp right here, nice hard brake. No grinding, no squeaking, no unusual brake noise or vibration. So again, exactly what we're looking for. Now listen, if you'd like to call or text me, I am the owner, my name is Jeremiah. Here it is, 316-262. 8267. You can call or text this 316 262 Vans. Now, I challenge you to ask the competition if they are dedicated enough 
to customer service to give you a direct line to the owner to call or text. Or do you get to call in and talk to an automated system, end up in somebody's voicemail and never get a call back? Or maybe you do get that live person, it's that super aggressive, pushy, used car salesman who's going to call you five times a day to ask if you're ready to make a deal. So if you're like me, sick of being treated like just a number by all these companies out there, you definitely want to avoid that annoying used car salesman. Give me a call, I'll walk you through start to finish, and I promise you, I'm going to sell the Sienna whether you buy it or not. There's absolutely zero pressure sales here. I guess we do have financing available. We can send an application to your phone or email address. And if computers aren't your thing, pick up the phone, give us a call. We're more than happy to take an application over the phone. Yes, we do take trade-ins, even from across the country. Whether standard or mobility vehicle, call me. I can explain how that works. And if you'd like to see our entire inventory, uh, with, if you hung, if you made the end of our video, sorry about that, made the end of our video, give us a like here on YouTube. We'd appreciate that. Give us a follow if you want to be the first to see all of our upcoming inventory. And if you ever do want to come in, please make sure you make that appointment with us. I know your time is valuable. We don't want to miss you. So make sure you make that appointment. And if you'd like to see our entire inventory with detailed videos just like this, free shipping, free Carfax reports, dozens of pictures, and no hidden fees, all from the most thorough and transparent mobility dealership in the country, check out our website 24 hours a day at www.mobility. 316.com that's mobility316.com and as always thank you so much for checking out mobility 316 home of affordable mobility solutions where mobility is affordable call us today